beautiful people. Um, oh man, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we're going to go through how to source material appropriately for your projects. Um, yeah, so this is where you're going to get irked. This is where you're going to get gouged for your money. Um, depending upon who you use, people are going to try to charge you the appropriate $500 for an order. And then people are going to try, try to charge you $1,000 for the same exact item. Depending on who you use, it's going to be a very laborious process, but I'm going to give you a couple of resources that will help you source material at the actual appropriate price for your project. So we have McMaster, we have Bodecker Plastics, we have TMS Titanium, we have Alrose Steel, and pretty much any, anybody that you can find you can use. There are a couple of conditionals that come to um, who you use and why you use them when you order material. Lead times and price. If you need parts, if you need material for parts in like a day or two days, uh, McMaster is your guy. I can do air and I can get most stuff delivered pretty quickly. Uh, next day, most of the time. Monday, my material will show up if I use air. Um, that typically doesn't happen. So I can get really fast deliveries on material depending upon who I use. Now, let's talk about the gouging section. So I have an example here of two by two by two feet. 110 copper bar. Now, copper is relatively expensive, right? Um, people strip wire, they steal wire, they, you know, rob people for it. $505.37. Let's say you don't have your tax exemption and you're ready to pay some shipping for ground delivered material. Now let's go to somewhere else. Two by two square 110 copper bar. 1,000 Sixteen dollars and fifty-four cents. There's nothing different. It's twenty-four inches. It's twenty-four inches. It's two by two. It's two by two. It's one ten copper. It's one ten copper. Price gouging. Um, so be careful of who you use to get material from. Now, if you're a material supplier, uh Put your contact information below. I would definitely like to see a list of people who supply materials because cross competition is very important. And if I only know about you know these four companies, I'm only going to use these four companies. So McMaster supplies material the fastest. So let's say a 6061 aluminum plate or bar. Um, let's go to oversized. Let's do a two inch by two inch piece. And let's say that we, we can only get two foot max. So let's go, you know, a two foot max piece like this. $109 and 29 cents, right? I can get it delivered Tuesday or I can get, get it delivered next day air, which is Monday because it's the weekend. But most of the time I can get it next day if I really need it. Um, so McMaster is for the lowest lead time orders you can possibly find. Bodecker plastics I use when I need very unique plastics or volume plastics. TMS titanium is who I use when I need exotic titanium in larger sizes. Alro is who I use when I need massive pieces. By massive, I mean, let's go to carbon steel bar stock. 1018 cold formed carbon steel bar stock, six inches wide and six inches thick and 12 feet long. One, add to cart. Okay. Six inches wide, six inches thick, 12 feet long, 1,469 pounds. Let's try to find that on McMaster. Width, six. Thickness, four. So you can't get a piece that big, nor can you get a piece that long. I had to go shut off my air compressor. So as you can see, there are size constraints with going with, with McMaster because they, the way that they deliver the material that they carry. So we need to find a competitor for Alro now. 
Um, the way that you do that is you find a material supplier in your area that warehouses material. We have uh, PA Steel here. So what you do is you find a material supplier in your area that warehouses material or flame cuts it or handles material processing, just raw material. And you send them a request for quote, they send you pricing, and then you submit a purchase order, um, meaning that you want to buy it. So here is some three inch plate, some three and a half inch plate, some three and a half inch plate, 5.5 wide, seven inches long. Um, so this is the breakdown of my purchase order through this company. Uh, I would use PA Steel if I wanted to get cross competition between Alro. And most likely, if I ordered this material off of PA Steel, it'd probably be 75% less um, of a price. So cross competition is uh, very important. You need to find a couple of material suppliers and submit quotes because you do get gouged. Um, you saw that C110 copper that we had on file here in the beginning of the video. Um, it was $500 here and it was eleven. It was $1,050 roughly back there. So there's big differences in material suppliers depending on who you use. Uh, one other good resource is online metals. Um, we can actually probably try to find a carbon steel six by six piece. So let's go carbon steel, um, square bar, 1018, and let's do six. Uh, they don't have it. So Alro would be the biggest metal supplier for an online store. And Online Metals is only selling a five by five inch carbon steel bar that's eight feet long for $7,000. So you can see massive price differences. Um, eight feet, five by five. Let's go to Alro. Add items to cart. Alro wants $2,912.99 for an eight foot piece, five by five square cold form 1018 bar. Uh, online metals wants $7,056.61 for the same material. This is everything totaled up on Alro. This is um, no shipping or anything included. Uh, let's go to cart. Let's get some shipping calculated. Let's get some taxes calculated. All right, so cross comparison between uh, price gouging and non-price gouging. So we have online metals doing a five inch carbon steel square bar, 1018 cold ruled, uh, five inches wide by five inches thick by 96 inches long, um, $8,046.03. Uh, they want to charge us almost $550 for shipping and $455 in tax. Let's go over here. We have a five inch square, so five by five cold form, 1018 bar, 96 inches. Uh, they want us to pay by credit card, um, $2,912.99. So they're gonna deliver this by truck. They have their own 18 wheeler service in our area. Um, these guys are gonna use probably some weird UPS service. Um, so yeah, everybody, please pay attention to your material buying processes because you can get extremely price gouged when you use the wrong material supplier. So until next time, take care. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below.